this is still of Black Talks by Pen. First, thank you po for visiting the channel. Um, for today's video, I'll be sharing with you this Dorstina Fotida. So, ito po siya. Um, this plant is native to Arabia and South Africa. And then, this is classified po as a succulent. But unlike uh, many succulents, this one has a codex. So, yung codex po, ito po siyang, itong plumpy na specialized stem and then it's where the plant stores its water and food and then this one can grow as tall as 12 inches so it can grow as tall as 12 inches pero hindi na po talaga matangkad na matangkad for this species for the photida yung leaves naman niya uh, this can go a bit longer pa pero not really that long Anyway, we got this plant last February during a plant show. And then, would you know, we only paid for this for 25 pesos or about 50 US cents. So it's really, really cheap. But this plant was just a seedling when we got this with just about four or five leaves. So talagang very, very tiny pa. And then very, very young. Um, I'm going to flash the picture of Darstina namin when this was small, so ito po siya. Uh, that figure is a Harry Potter figure that's about six, five to six inches tall. Um, isa po siyang Funko Pop toy. So you can, if you're familiar with Funko Pop, you can see the size, and uh, you can gauge the size reference siguro. Within the last almost six months, this plant has not only given us flower, but it has also given us seeds. No newbie mistake, we didn't know when we should harvest the seeds. So the first flower which gave us seed is eto po siyang th this one. Unfortunately, we were not able to get the seed because the seed popped out of, out of the flower and fell to the floor. We didn't know that the seeds will pop out. The moment you see something similar, a brown exposed thing on the center of the flower, know that it is the seed and you can now harvest it manually by removing it from the flower. The moment you see that flower there are green enclosure, it means that the seeds have been popped out and then you are too late. Hopefully you can find the seed on the floor or on the pot itself. So you have to harvest the seeds as soon as you see them. That about that it's about to be popped out because in just one to two hours the seeds will be gone from the flower and then you might not be able to find it on the floor. What others actually do is they they plant the dorsina in a bigger, wider pot, para um, in anticipation of the seeds popping out and then they expect like once the flower forces the seed out, it will just fall on the soil within the pots and then it will just grow from there but in our case our plant it has a small pot kaya nung nag pop yung seed malamang talaga a uh, higher chance of it falling on the floor the next time we saw a uh, flower that's about to give seeds we did the plastic wrap on this flower we missed four seeds but there is one seed that is about to burst. So in order for us not to miss this one, we put this flower inside a small Ziploc bag. And then we made sure that the bag will be sealed well. Um, this way, when the flower releases the new seeds, it will land inside the bag and not on the pot or on the floor. Luckily, the following day when we check the plastic bag, we saw that there were already three seeds inside it. We may miss the four ones, but at least we got three new seeds. So this is the first time that we were able to cut Dorstinia fotida seeds. And it's really a good thing and a good experience for us. We still have a few flowers on our plant and we're hoping that all this will give us more seeds because more seeds, more possibility of propagations. So there. When it comes to plant care, naman, this plant, like most succulent, this one, uh, bright light. So we put this outside but not really under direct 
sign but it's really bright like on a ledge we put this and then we water this more often than the regular succulents so like every three days or when we notice that the soil is dry so this is the first Durstina that we have in our collection and we've been seeing more and more species that we really like to add to our home gardens. So maybe in a year or two, the dami na po yung Durstina plant namin. For now, we're very excited to grow the seeds of this plant and I'll be giving an update in a month or two or as soon as we see the seeds have sprouted to a new plant. So ayan po, maraming maraming salamat po. Thank you po for watching Pen Fire. Sana po ay mag-subscribe pa po kayo if hindi pa kayo nakata-subscribe. Thank you po so much. Bye-bye.